simulator is really specific to one type of racing, and this one type of racing also happens to be completely unique in racing alone. It is the answer to a question, what could we do for a kart simulator knowing all the things that we know about haptic feedback, VR, every technology we have, and say, how realistic can we get? We replicated the violence, the vibration, the physical effort needed to turn the steering system in a slick little package that can be put into a corner and easily driven. One of the challenges we threw ourselves was, okay, what if it was only VR and it had no screens? Could it still be easy to use, easy to start, you know, uh, still a compelling experience? And we nailed it. So one of the things that we realized with the physicality of karting is you're also in the air. I mean, your entire body is in the air and that is a physical feedback right and we've done a lot of work with wind simulation in the past and really high powered fans and that seemed like a perfect fit for this project even more so than any of the other projects we've done because you are literally in the open air you know so again we reached for extremely high powered fans we built our own software to control it um, and it really adds to the experience I think I'm most proud of the fact that our team really had no other example to go by. And this was so different from what they've normally done that they really kind of opened up their minds to the fact that this is a blank slate. What could we do? This is an area that we normally, it's not a comfort zone for them. And that was the whole goal was to push them out of their comfort zone on the design and execution side and they delivered in spades. I think the thing is just amazing to drive.